Hey everyone, this is AVJV Gaming bringing you guys episode number 64 of this Black Ops 2 Emblem tutorial for football badges. And as you guys can see up on screen, we have a subscriber request which is for the badge of Brentford. So, for, so for some of you guys, I'm just going to explain in this uh, episode of what's happening at the minute. So, as most of you guys know, I know a lot of people have exams. So, what I'm going to do is upload very like three or four videos maybe in a week instead of just having full seven videos uh, every day. So instead of having seven videos, sorry, in the week, um, have like three videos that's spaced out over the week, and uh, hopefully that'll help some of you guys out. So it's not too many videos out there, and uh, yeah, it'll be a bit of um, a bit of a bit of relaxation as well. And furthermore to that, guys, um, in this emblem, all the shapes here are pretty much from the default shape, so you don't have to worry about uh, getting confused with making this emblem. I made it as simple as possible. Just with some of the shapes over there, guys. I think that's a tube, and with this one, you got to play around slightly and make it go all the way to the top. As you can see there, just uh, we're going to push it back a couple layers so it hides behind the rest, and then uh, that's about that bit done. But yeah, guys, I'll just talk about the rest of the things that are going to happen. Trading at the minute, guys, is going kind of slowly, so I'll bring the trading series sort of coming out maybe um, I think after maybe around the Champions League final. I told you guys there's going to be a technique for that uh, final and I'll bring that out before the final and I'll bring one out after the final. For those of you guys who look for Black Ops 2 emblems, these will be out probably most likely in June as um, I'm going to get rid of all the emblems I have at the minute. So I think I've got five at the moment that uh, need to get commentaries over and then uploaded for you guys. And then also I'm going to have um, my journey series guys for all you guys who watch my FIFA videos as well. That will be out over... Um, I think that will become daily. That will actually, I'll start bringing that out daily, and you guys will see how the team goes and which players we actually buy. Because I said I'm going to buy Ronaldo, Messi, Robin, and Ribery, and also Neymar somewhere in there. I'm also planning to do a skill compilation, guys, for those of you guys who, um, you know, want to see the end of FIFA 13 for me and sort of into the beginning of FIFA 14. So that'll be something I'm going to work on as well. And yeah, so we're going to just have uh, pretty much Black Ops 2 videos here and then also hybrids and reasonable squad builders for really good squads and uh, squads I've used that will be interesting for everyone. So as you guys see here, I'm just grabbing a tube, a tube and we're going to just put it over the top. As you can see, that's the same shape. We just pushed it up a little bit and as you can see, we're just going to make the top bit of the Brentford badge. So it's just going to cut it off sort of and then what we're going to do is go and clone that over, make it white and then just push it up slightly and uh, stretch it on the free scale. So it'll sort of give you that. Um, it'll sort of cancel out the top bit that was looking a bit, you know, um, protruding over the top. And now you've got the actual main bit of the badge done. And what we're going to do is go and work on the different colours and everything inside. I think there's also, a, um, I think it was a bee or a wasp inside the middle. So we're going to get that done as well. And also, I think there's some swords over there. So I'm going to get those done as well. So as you see here, just going to do the stripes first on the top layer. And with these stripes, guys, you don't go into the black line that I've put between the two red bits. Because um, as you can see, once you put them there, um, I'm just playing around with the different layers. As you can see, they're all going to be covered up. So you don't really need to worry about the excess bit that's going over the top. So you just have to watch out for the bottom line. And this bit is very careful, guys. You have to make sure you have the exact number of stripes in there. So uh, as you see, I'm just pushing everything over, making sure there's enough space. And then I go back and sort of uh, clone over them all and make them smaller and thinner. So I, I did this process quite a few times when I was making the emblem. Um, this one took me around an hour to make, but recording-wise, it took me, I think, 15 minutes to record. And um, yeah, it came out really nice, guys. So you, hopefully you guys will enjoy it. I'm going to end this commentary here because i got to go. And uh, hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. I am going to be bringing out the other emblems I have. I have made quite a few, so um, they will be out very soon. They'll be coming out over this... Um, over this few days period so if you guys have enjoyed the episode please leave a like and subscribe and this has been AVJV Gaming and I'll catch you guys for the next episode